it's going right now. Okay, go. Hold on. Let's see if it, it, it really is streaming. I don't know how much longer we can stream. There's a lot going on here. It's a hurricane. It's there's there's uh, there's waves are coming over the bow. They're coming into the boat. I, I'm not sure how long. Oh god. Okay, stop. You got me in the eye. All right. I'm obviously. <laughs> I'm obviously with uh, two cool people, so let's let's set the camera up and let's. Oh, thanks. <laughs> do you dab or do you? Yeah. You block that shit. All right. <laughs> yeah, set the camera up. Let's go. Excuse the vibration. What's up, guys? It's been a while since I've done a live stream. So give us a sec. Let us set the camera up, frame it, and uh, <laughs> we'll make this happen. <laughs> Can we do that over? Can we take like a take two with that? <laughs> Uh, we are actually in the bottom trough of a hurricane, but it's um, it's hitting way north of us. It was pretty rocking here this morning. So uh, what will happen is the hurricane will come above you, and then the, all the wind will suck towards that because it's actually a low, uh, low pressure. So that's how hurricanes work. If you see a barometer going dropping really fast, that means something bad is happening. And so, and because the the pressure in the middle is really really low. It just starts sucking all the air from like hundreds of miles away. And now, instead of the wind coming from the east, like all the trade winds do, it's coming from the south because it's sucking up towards that storm. So because of that, we have had a very interesting day. And I haven't been able to do any work, so I thought maybe I'd just do a live stream to show you guys uh, what's up. And I decided to do it on these guys' boat. So this is Sailing Too Short. They have a, a YouTube channel. It's up and coming. I think it's one of those like sleeper channels where they're so cool that you're going to be like, holy shit, how did I not freaking know about these guys? <laughs> definitely, definitely. But this is Darren and Crystal. Hi, guys. Crystal. Hubs is Darren. Pleasure to meet you all. I think they know which is which. And, uh, in case you didn't know, we have two small dogs, although she's scared now because I was spraying him oh. with the... With the, the, the <laughs> The puppies. <laughs> we love puppies. This is Sammy. This one's missing half its nose. I don't know what happened. Did, Sorry. Did you, did you abuse she that dog? It. Part pug. Part what? It's not all pug? No. No, this is because the pointy ears makes it Frenchy. Oh, it's a French bulldog. Yes. So it makes Which, and pug? French is pug, uh, bulldog, and terrier mix. She just got more of the French face. I mean, pug face. Pug face. Oh, pug Jesus. Face. I'm, face. I'm very confused now. Yeah. It's alright. Nobody cares about the spe yeah. specificities of dog breeds. Alright, let's see. Hey, Chris Grieve is here. What's up? That's my buddy from the Navy. I, li I lived on this guy's couch for like a month during COVID because I had lost my boat. Well, he's a nice and I'm guy. Like, I'm like, Chris, <laughs> I'm coming over. He's like, get here, man. <laughs> um, cool dude. Jason Gomez is here. Jason Babaki. Andy C. What's up? No sound. Oh. Oh, and then you realized it was you. Dick. <laughs> you can't put that on there. I'm like, I'm, I'm so gullible. I'm like, no sound. Oh my God, it's ruined everything. Oh, it's your fault. Thanks a lot, man. Appreciate that. Are you sinking? No, we're not sinking. God, man, I am not going to ever live that down. But it's only because you're on our boat. Oh, yeah. yeah. It yeah, could yeah, be yeah. totally, yeah. Yeah. Seabrook, Texas. <laughs> wow, who's the cutie? Um, that's his girl. Hi, Jim. This is Jim Kempton in Ohio. The storm is heading for my Florida home. Yes. We have a Florida home, too? Yeah, they have a Florida home, too. You, you, you guys, it's going to break up. This is the first storm of the, of the season. It's, yeah. There's no fucking way it's going to cause any damage to you guys in Florida. Uh, I hype I, it up on the news in it, Florida. It did, it did hit the Antilles pretty hard, but uh, they hype it up on the news. you got to remember that. They always have to get really excited about the first hurricane of the season. I mean, it's... <laughs> Uh, CR says, my man, gonna take me a minute to get used to the new do. Dude, I sailed in here, and I know a lot of people here, and every single person I went up to, I was like, what up, bro? And they all looked at me like, who the hell, who the hell are you, man? And I'm like, James, tattoos, remember? Oh, James, yeah, whoa, dude, what happened? So if you guys haven't seen yet, I cut the locks because, um, honestly, because I kept hitting my head and, like, ripping out pieces of hair, and then when I put my, my ponytail in, it was just this big, like, monster on the top of my head. And I just, one day, just got sick of it. Wait, you said locks? Lock. I had like, long, long oh, hair. Oh, oh no, no, no. Not like locks. your locks. Are, th those are dreads. Those are dreads. Dread locks. Oh, yeah. My, I was talking about my golden locks. Oh, I, I had, like, nice, I have nice hair, man. 
I yeah, to... I was actually caught off guard by it when you Were you? When I first saw you. Yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah I was like, have long on. hair. Yeah. 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 Oh god. Yeah. yeah. So Joe Breezy is here. What's up? I seventy five near Atlanta. Uh, Uncle Muir is here. Wayne Griffith. This is like all my patients. I love it. Rico's here. What's up, guys? Hi. Hi. <laughs> What's up? I'm in Bonaire, on a lagoon, on a lagoon. Actually, leopard. Cue the lagoon footage. Oh no. Well, I'm on a well, leopard right yeah, now. Nah, right, this yeah, is yeah. a this okay, is a much much better. Boat. He got here. He got here on this much better boat. So, this is the boat I'm on right now. And I have to say, this is some good drone footage. I don't know if you guys can still hear me. Actually, will you guys let me know if you can if you can still hear me through this? Because I didn't set this up to have an overdub during all of the stuff, but um, I would really like to know if I if you guys can hear my voice. So, yeah, I'm on this lagoon. Um, it's actually under sale right now, which it, this is like a rare bird, a, a lagoon <laughs> lagoon under sail. I don't think I've ever <laughs> seen one before. It's like it's like the 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 finless brown tuna. Have you ever seen one of those? It's like a monkey walking on two feet. <laughs> Dude, I, I saw a guy, like, literally, with my own eyes, get bit by a monkey walking on two feet. Because he tried to pet it, like, pet it on the head. Oh, Who pets a monkey? Was that in Asia or no, something? No, this was like in... I would forget. I think it was San Blas? Something around there. Nah, right I think on. it was I think it was Panama, yeah. I hear you. Oh, sweet. Hear you live. Good. Right. Steve Lambert's here. Uh, John Haywood is here. Amber Callahan, what's up, Burr? That's an old friend. <laughs> Hello from Puyallup, Geek with a Radio. Well, Geek with a Radio, Amber and I are both from Puyallup, so uh, that's crazy. Wayne Griffith says that was funny. Yeah, well, I'm not a big fan of the goose. I'm, I'm just going to tell you right now. Uh, I don't care if it offends people, if they're shit boats. Um, th th <laughs> this thing made about 70 degrees off the wind. Which is just, like, insanely bad. But, you know, they're very comfortable. Okay. Great. It's made more They're not sailboats. Comfort. I'm a sailor. I'm a sailor. Yeah. Not yeah. a sailor, but yeah. I'm sure people are pretty familiar with the channels out there that are covering some of the issues that yeah. <laughs> Lagoon's have. Yeah. yeah, you know what I was, think I was thinking? <laughs> you know, I'm pretty close to um, Parlay. I'd like to go meet that guy. He just seems cool as shit. Yeah. So I'm thinking about going down to Sunblast and seeing Plucky from uh, Sailing Into Freedom. Oh, yeah. And spearing some fish with him. And then going over to Linton Bay, because that's right next door, like 40 miles. Oh, seeing cool. Parlay. And then uh, there's a couple other people there. And then maybe going to Bocas to see Delos and, and Rick Moore just because um, I think they're, they're, I've never met them. And they're pretty cool. I've talked to them a couple times. What is your plan? Are you going west? or are you? That's the plan. Yeah, you're I'm so giving you're you it right okay. now. Right, yeah. yeah, gotcha. And then wasn't sure if you're talking about like flying yeah. there again or taking no, no, another no, boat no. there. <laughs> that'd apparently, be funny. Yeah, like, that'll convince somebody else to take rides, it. Apparently, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I like my boat. It sells really nice. I'm actually really, really happy with the oyster. Yeah. I, I, I really want another cat until I go sailing on a cat, and I'm like, well, I kind of like the way my boat sails, man. But you have an oyster. Oysters are pretty. They Pretty sail epic sailors. so nice. Yeah, like, you know the Windex? You know the Windex at the top of the mast? Yeah. Mine's inside the boxes! <laughs> <laughs> so excited. Uh, okay, so tell us a little bit about you. I'm sorry, I, I talk too much. Hey, That's man. Good. It's your what, channel. How, how did you get into this? What what are you doing? Uh, man, you know, life just got old. Working every day doing 9 to 5s, like that, it, it gets a little quick, man. So, uh, yeah, I, we start, we're we watching YouTube channels, this kind of stuff. I think we were watching your channel, probably. And uh, yeah, it really just kind of got came the bug. It became our goal. Yeah, Yeah, it became a goal. We set the goal and we made it happen. We really had the plan of like not doing this till we hit 40. Uh, I'm 36. Crystal's, Crystal's her age. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we kind of fast-tracked it. But, uh, yeah, they, that's that, I mean, that's what happens, I think. I think most people kind of just get into this and just go. You just gotta go. You gotta make the decision. If you're gonna do this, just do it. Don't think. Don't think too much. Well, I mean, there's a little bit more of a backstory, but you can check out our channel. Yeah, to find yeah, out exactly. The real check truth, out our channel if you really want the what details. What really pushed us over? The channel is sailing too short. Yeah. I can't write anything down because my I have so much <laughs> crap plugged into my computer. I don't have another another thing for my keyboard. Um, so I still have no laptop. I'm still working off a Mac Mini, which I like, but the problem with that is it doesn't have a display. So I'm using their ridiculously big you gotta see this actually <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> we're obnoxious Let's just uh oh, oh, oh wow. you knocked the hdmi out oh, again <laughs> no. well you know what we don't need to see look at 
Look at this TV. That's so funny. I just breathed, breathed on it, breathed on it a little bit. Okay, fix it. Okay. Well, we knew something was going to break. We're oh, done. we're back. Yeah, we're back? Don't touch it, though. Okay, so look, I'll show you guys. This is what we see. Boom. Uh-oh, it looks like we're uh, we're lagging a little bit now. It'll, it'll come back. Whatever. Here's the other puppy. What's up, buddy? Frankie! Good boy. <laughs> I guess that's the smart one? Yeah. Yeah. For sure. So let's get some more backstory with you guys. I'm gonna frame this a little better. Oop, oop, oop. Boom, done. How'd you guys meet? What, what's your story? How'd you guys get into boating? How, how did you get such a beautiful boat? What's the, give us, yeah. the, give us the skinny on that. So, I mean, we're, we're from Florida. We're both uh, born and raised in Florida. I, uh, I gotta had, go. Uh, what's that? <laughs> I said, I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> whatever, whatever. Yeah, so I, I had a tech company in Florida. We did uh, automation. Uh, home theaters working for you know uber rich people and uh, it worked out pretty well for me I sold that company and that was uh, the foundation of the funding for this boat uh, yeah and crystal yeah so I did the 95 corporate world accounting and IT um, we did pretty good I guess um, on land but uh, I don't know things changed we knew we wanted to do this but then Sometimes tragedies can push you forward a little quicker because you realize life is too short, which is where the name came from. Yeah. So dad, and he had passed away, and that kind of happened. Anything can happen, let's just go. And honestly, it was it was a, a tough transition, but I think it's the best choice that we ever made. <laughs> yeah, I, I'll sorry. tell you, you don't realize, yeah. you know, how vulnerable your, your life is until you experience it firsthand with loved ones, and it, it really does. Oh, yeah. Put a damper on things, but it also, you know, kick Push you in the you ass and get you to do stuff. So, yeah. you know, I mean, it's it's something good that came out of something terrible. But yeah, I, I I hope that some people can realize without having that kind of tragedy in their life that you know, life is too short, man. Go out there, do what you want to do. If you have a dream, do what you got to do to make it happen. I wouldn't waste time. I mean, I think uh, beautiful dude. Most yeah. people in the boating community <clears throat> have kind of adopted that mentality. For one reason or another, you never know exactly why, but yeah, it's. I'm sorry you lost your pop, dude. Yeah. That's my pop is one of my best friends. Yeah. Thank you. But I think you did what you just said. Yeah, no, I mean, and and he knew that this is what we plan to do. I mean, like like we said, it was cancer, so he knew it was coming, so it was a discussion, and yeah. So I I feel like I'm honoring him. Yeah. Kind of nice. Oh no! What happened? Oh. Um. Well, you had an error, and then it went offline. Great. What Can we get mean? back online?